The rally was aimed at informing the members of the public why a basic income grant is essential and what impact it will make. The coalition held nationwide marches two months ago, after which they handed over a petition to Minister Doreen Sioka, who received it on behalf of the president. Member of the coalition, Victoria Kalwenya, stated that the unconditional basic income grant has the potential to reduce poverty, malnutrition, and uneven distribution of funds. The conditional grant provided by the government currently only applies to those who had been benefiting from the food bank and those falling under the marginalized feeding program. She added that the income grant should be universal and not discriminate against income or living conditions. If the government is serious about eradicating poverty, a universal basic income grant of 500 per month per person for all Namibian aged 0 to 59 may represent a better strategy to do it. Objecting universal and conditional basic income grant, a welfare program which has been scientifically validated by various studies to be by far the fastest and the most cost efficient in addressing poverty. Another member of the Universal Basic Income Grant Coalition, Chipura Chipura, says the current conditional basic income grant of the government is ineffective as it discriminates and leaves loopholes due to the fact that it is funded from the already existing food bank program and the marginalized special feeding program. This program has failed immensely and it has not even reached its first stage, right? So what do we want as a Universal Basic Income Grant Coalition within Namibia? We want government to give people what they deserve. We want government to give people what they need from their natural resources. Because the resources are whose? The resources belong to us. The resources belong to the state, right? So we want government to implement a universal basic income grant for each and every Namibian who deserves what they need from their natural resources. Chipura pointed out that the universal income grant should be funded with the money government makes from the country's resources as it belongs to all citizens. NH Moabib, NBC News, Fentuk.